All right, everybody, this is Shake and Bake. I hope everybody's having a great 2015. I'm back on homebrew. I want to tell you about some new things here. It's really, really cool. Uh, this is my updated Miller Special, kind of a 1920s racer. Uh, they are having a competition on Homebrew's uh, Steam page. You can win some free keys, and if you get the top dogs hot, your vehicle will get put in as a default vehicle. So I'll put the link to the competition below. Here's my updated vehicle, but what I want to tell you about is really cool here is they have added and been and i've been bothering these poor guys uh for a skinning system now this is not the official skins but what at least gives you is something these are actually armor plating but it gives you some basic shapes you can use these um and i think there's one more hold on a second here right here so you can use i use these on this vehicle i have another a version that's where i use wings as skinning but the wings do cause drag so i do like this better this baby is a beast compared to the other one i built wait till you see the performance of this baby right here which i call you can't see it there it's called shakester kind of like roadster but shakester so awesome awesome they're getting some new stuff in uh, homebrew. I love seeing that, but let's go ahead. I'm going to show you what this thing can do now. Let's do it. Okay, so here's the old Shakester right here. I love this car. Uh, I do like the look of it. I mean, it, this is armor plating. It's not a skinning system, so it's going to look a little more blocky, but you can get creative with it and make some cool stuff. I've yet to make a plane with it. I'm still working on that, uh, having some challenges, getting back, but I love how this has turned out. Again, this is based on the Miller Special racing cars, and I love this thing. Okay, so let's get in this. I'm going to show you something. Look at that. Got some brake lights in the back there. Uh, what I really like about this new vehicle I've made is, one, is the power of this thing. Um, hold on a second. Let's get out because what we're going to do is we're going to show you this feature here. They've added these racetracks. And some of you may not know this, but you can come in here. You can do this. And you actually can race around these tracks uh and you know try to improve upon your times uh race your friends whatever and so let's do this. i'm gonna show you this thing this is a beast man i'm it, i mean it may not look like there's much going on with this car but man if you can tweak these cars and vehicles just right you can get some serious performance out of it let's do this I love drifting this thing. A little bit of sliding going on. I like that. But I mean, I'm, we're cooking, man. We're cooking. I got to slow down a little bit here, so I'm flipping. And what I do like is there's enough of a little bit of um, catch with the tires, traction, that you can flip this thing, which may happen. So it's just that right balance. All right, here we go. Come on, shake. Don't screw it up. Woo-hoo! Get the lay. Oh! Oh! <laughs> Damn! Oh, right like that. Get rid of it. Oh, I lost it. So I lost it. I think I'll probably see the bottom of the vehicle. It actually, you know, turned out like a real vehicle on the bottom. Um, I like that too. And so I tried to really add some detail here, and I'll show you. So I tried to add some detail to the vehicle here. I got a little stick shift. I got my copy bug paste and home rulers. Shout out to those guys. Uh, I got my um, instrument panel there. And uh, so it feels like a nice, good size cockpit, a little bit of detail. I got the little cap here for my radiator, uh, some, you know, different piping going on for the wheels and from the engine. Of course, my uh, Shakester license plate and the spare tire. So I like how this has turned. I like the detail. And uh, I wish you guys the best with your vehicles. This is a great game. Um, if anything else, if you like to build stuff, you know, you like be creative you know after i build stuff you know i have fun driving it but to be honest i have the most fun just building things it's a lot of fun so let's end this i'm going to do some more driving i want to show you this thing driving through uh this course up here because i'm telling you this thing has got some torque it's it handles uh, i mean like tokyo drift i said that last time but i sort of feel like i'm drifting these corners let me change a view for you guys I like the view better in the car, but just to get to give you a sense of, oh, too much, too much. And that's what I like. I like the fact 
that it actually, if you get a little too crazy, it will flip on you. I mean, if, if that wasn't present, it'd get boring. So you're always right when you're turning, you're on the edge. You just, you can feel those tires. You can hear them. They're right at the edge of. Flipping. Okay, so let's end it with driving through this course. I'll put, I'll shut up, put some tunes on, and uh, let's do this.